this is the energy vibration days in for um the month of december full moon from the 15th of december till the 15th of january now these are timeless readings this was the time that it was taken up so whenever you choose to listen to this reading is whenever it was meant for you okay because these are timeless reading this is for the pisces cancer and scorpion i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back we have changes on youtube so for the extended of this reading and the extended uh, um all extended daily you can pick them up on youtube now you can join my channel to join my channel you have three different subscription so you can take the first subscription where you get the monthly reading second subscription is all extended and the big subscription is that we can have one and one um question answers one and one um extended um reading and life okay so um first going to look at the fire sign people and this is uh, the people who were born 6 a.m to 6 p.m so okay water sign Ooh, water sign okay who is this this is a pisces 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 okay so pisces you're going to be finding out something in this full moon whatever is transpiring and whatever that you weren't seeing you guys are going to be seeing in this in the full moon especially the pisces okay so whatever that you guys weren't seeing this in this full moon you're going to be seeing it okay so we have the energy of the devil so a pisces could or some of you could be realizing that there's negative forces that is here okay and uh, i'm seeing a judgment call um because negative forces is here whatever these negative forces is um i'm seeing the energy uh judge i call on a uh, capricorn taurus or virgo okay and i am seeing um the sense that maybe this person wants to end a relationship or this person um wants to leave something behind okay so i'm seeing a new start coming up but there's a negative forces that is at end and we're going to be looking at who and what is that negative forces i am seeing that someone is coming screaming at you um this could be an aquarius gemini or libra or i'm seeing people in power i'm seeing money coming in for a capricorn whoever this capricorn is this capricorn if you're in a relationship with this person she's going to be sitting really pretty on some money okay she is going to be really sitting pretty on some money and if you're in business with this person now i'm seeing some deceptive situation coming in um with an aries Leo or sagittarius this is a person between the age of 18 and 45 whoever this person is i'm seeing them in the reverse they have stolen some money from the capricorn but i'm seeing a strong foundation is coming up because whoever it could be your partner that um there was a theft that was done and it has to do with a young person so the knight of wands is in reverse this was a deceptive person if you go back and listen to the air the fire sign reading um whoever this person is it was affecting you guys i go back and watch that fire sign reading it's free on YouTube because I don't know what it was when I was doing the fireside reading it was this man I was talking about this man is 65 years and older or this man is between 55 years and older this was a nasty man that was using negative forces um, to hang you okay this man this Aries man was using some negative forces to affect you cancers okay this man used negative forces to get their way with you and you were dangling like a little puppet and it has to do with this fire sign man whoever this fire sign man is a hold man or a nasty deceptive person that use negative forces to get whatever they want in life and there was you young people between the ages and you um you want a sign go back and check out the fire reading because you will see my message this is who and pisces are going to be finding out who this person is because uh, the truth you're going to be finding out that this devil energy has to do with this man this the devil energy there was negative forces coming at you and it has to do with this man there is no start for him because whatever he gives out he's gonna get it right back okay 
um there is um um there is something at your work but you're going to be okay um some of you um i'm seeing money is coming in there is something about work and something about uh, it's like maybe some of you have to buy a car something with an organization but it's not bad it's just as if you're going to be receiving some help okay you're not going to ask for the help but you're going to be receiving some help some of you a situation has now ended um with a taurus virgo or a capricorn it could be a virgo person for some of you uh some of you could be a taurus person okay so some of you who are dealing with a taurus virgo uh, Taurus Virgo person this situation has ended if you were married to this person I think they're, they're going to divorce you and take everything so if you're married to a Virgo they're going to divorce you and take everything if you were married to um, a Taurus I'm seeing this lady is going to decide to leave you or you're leaving a Taurus behind okay I'm seeing news coming in and I'm seeing some of you are going to be finding out something about a uh, young Aries Leo or Sagittarius you're going to be finding out something about a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius or this person is going to be wanting to connect with you and you're like mm, especially you um, Pisces I'm seeing a young young um, person is trying to connect with you is a Leo a young Leo is going to try to connect with you and you're like why is this person trying to connect with me and whoever this young Leo is is between the age of 18 and 45 and a lot of communication you Scorpio you Pisces are going to be having a lot of communication between you and this young Leo okay and it's as if they want to get married to you or something like that but or they want to come live with you or something like that but uh, listen <laughs> what is this so whatever is is transpiring for you fire sign um you are connected with a young leo uh, or a sagittarius a sagittarius for some of you and a leo for some of you and it's as if either she wants it has something to do with our stability so she is asking you for help or something but you know whatever it is um, ladies and gentlemen you have to be you have to stand strong I'm seeing some of you uh, is gonna be finding out about an Aries they are Sagittarius man it's an Aries man and an Aries man has stolen some money there's a lot of things coming about uh, out about this Aries man this Aries man is going to see some jail time. This Aries man has been using negative forces. Uh, um, you know, um, it's as if this Aries man use negative forces to, um, it's like you're a puppet, it's puppet. So this Aries man use negative forces and I see um, it's going to come to an end because it's as if it, it's, 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 it's returned to him. It's as if you want to sign people realize that is this Aries man has been using you as a puppet to do some negative things because they 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 place like a negative forces or negative energy and you're going to be releasing it and return it to him okay some of you Leos some of you um Pi yeah this is a Pisces and a Leo Pisces I'm seeing a Leo is in problem and is communicating with you that they need some help so whatever that is all about i'm going i'm going i'm going i'm going to look at the moon sign people the people who were born um 6 p.m to 6 a.m to see what is happening for those pisces remember the extended regions are here pisces so um you can join the channel to receive the rest of this reading um everyone has their individual readings pisces cancer okay so the sun comes out in the reverse for you moon people i was just talking about um that and the sun comes out in the reverse for you people whatever is happening for you sun people i'm seeing some of you trying to balance out the situation and deal with the situation the sun is in the reverse it could be health um, problems that some of you are not feeling really um good okay so there could be some health problems going on some of you um um 
uh, young women between the age of 18 and 45 I see you're trying to balance out things because things are not looking that good for you because you have connected with an Aries Lee or Sagittarius old man and it is not looking well whatever you're doing it's going to be backfiring so some of you young ladies between the age of 18 and 45 as connected with an old Aries Lee or Sagittarius man I'm not seeing it coming up as a father it could be a father for some of you but it's not looking well because I'm seeing a Capricorn is taking you guys down this Capricorn is standing up and just ripping everything away uh, it says Capricorn um, but um, this Capricorn is standing up because this Capricorn realizes uh, the deceptiveness. Judgment call is coming out. Judgment call is coming out. And this judgment call is that people are going to see who you are. You have stole a lot of money. You, um, young ladies between the ages of 18 and 45, a judgment call is coming out because you have stolen a lot of money from a company. So you... Um, you ladies between the ages of 18 and 45 a lot and 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 you have worked together with an aries they are sagittarius now um i see that a, a, um, a woman this woman is a taurus virgo or a capricorn she is looking at the whole thing she found out and see the connection between who you people are and trust me this woman is taking you down she's ending this thing okay she's ending this thing this woman decide i am ending this thing i am not stopping until I end this thing so some of you young um, ladies um, um, between the ages of 15 and 45 uh, 18 and 45 you and this old man which is not is your partner in crime ladies 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 is your partner in crime and you are about to go down with this person okay so i'm seeing news coming in whatever news is coming in i'm seeing a lot of news coming in and some of you are trying to balance out situation where there's a lot fastness there's a lot of fastness in the christmas week i'm seeing some of you dealing with a young taurus virgo or capricorn person you a virgo person you and a virgo person whoever you are that is in a relationship with a virgo person um, I'm seeing that you and this Virgo person, um, however way you have come in some money, I'm seeing that you um, are on the investigation. They found out the truth. An organization, corporation, or people found out the truth of an old Aries Leo or Sagittarius man. They found out the truth about an old Aries Leo or Sagittarius man. And justice is coming up because I'm seeing that this um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is standing up for equality and justice. Okay, um, she is really standing up to equality and justice of a deceptive, deceptive situation that has transpired. I'm seeing she's using the sword of truth to cut down whatever deceptiveness that was happening i'm seeing that um there is a queen there is um some of you um i've done some deceptive things because as you notice i'm seeing the lawyer um or people in power is realizing what this the king of one has done what the king of one has done and the deceptive thing that has transpired okay so um i see the truth is coming out about this king of one i'm seeing people realize how deceptive this person is now whoever this lady is and i gotta ask who is this lady because i'm seeing these two ladies there's another message that is coming out i'm seeing the knight of swords i'm seeing an investigation is happening um you ladies that is in a relationship or is connected to, with an aries Lee, a virgo person or aries Lee or a sagittarius no um, taurus virgo or a capricorn person i'm seeing you under investigation and they're going to be finding out that you have stolen some money all right um the queen of pentacles and the queen of swords the queen of pentacles and the queen of swords 
I'm saying that some of you are in love with um, the Queen of Pentacles, but if your wife is the Queen of Swords, she's like, yeah, there is some, um, yeah. So there was some this, the, there was some um, um, deceptiveness that has been going on, and um, I'm seeing a, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, whoever you are. This is whoever you are is between the age of eighteen and forty-five, and if you had a relationship with a Gemini, Aries, or Gemini, he, she, he is gonna, he is gonna find out that you're in a relationship with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. You and a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn has been taking money from this Gemini, a lot of money, and I'm seeing justice is going to come in and take you down. You and that young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn is going to jail is a Virgo person because you and that person have been stealing. From from the Gemini and you're going to jail okay a lot of people keep on saying yeah but you're saying that we're going to jail yes you're going to jail because if you stole something and they find out and they realize how deceptive you have been you're going to jail whoever this person is is a cancer so if you're a cancer between the ages of 18 and 45 and as deceptively work together with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person don't try to run because they're going to find you okay you have deceivingly in a relationship with a Gemini and you have been stealing from the Gemini you have lift the Gemini up with a lot of money you are a cancer between the ages of 18 and 45 you have lift the Gemini up with of a lot of money and you have lift uh, Taurus Virgo um, um, this they're coming down on you because they found out what you have done okay bye oh my god why are people so deceptive I just can't understand why are people so deceptive all right Pisces if you were in a relationship with um with a uh, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and they had legal issues or there was some deceptive things against this person it's going to be over and a new start is going to be coming up okay and this is for the Pisces if a Pisces was married to an Aquarian Gemini or Libra um, this person realized that you were in love with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I'm saying that um, whatever if you because it, it can be a Libran a Libran woman some of you could have married to a Libran woman, but a Capricorn woman at the same age group, 45 years and older, you were in love with this person. Okay? So what I'm seeing is that some of you could be having this new start with this, um, with this Libran, okay? Or it could be a legal issue that you're divorcing this Libran, but it's affecting you, Pisces. Whatever is transpiring, it's affecting you, Pisces. So I'm seeing a Capricorn and a Pisces together, but whatever it was, there was some legal issue, but this is going to be over, and you and this Capricorn is going to have a new start because they found out the lies and the deceptiveness, okay? Woo! I'd love to read for you guys just one by one. Um... Um, everybody has their own stories and these are general readings ladies and gentlemen so if it doesn't affect you but whoever know that you were driven to true negative energy it has to do with an Aries man an old Aries man the man is deceptive some of you were doing business with an old Aries man that man is seriously seeing some good jail time and it's good for him it's a nasty person the person was using negative forces. He works with a young Pisces Cancer or Scorpion is a Cancer, a young Cancer. He worked with a young Cancer. This is a young person that he has manipulated to get them to work with. And they, and what you people weren't aware is that they were using negative forces. What a son of a bitch. Sorry. Um but uh, um it's all gonna come out and you know something these people that use negative forces to affect other people you know it, it always shows on you you know i can just know people who um work with negative forces I, i'm like i just skip far all right um water sign people i'm seeing money coming in your world you're gonna have some luck with money Okay, or new assets, new property. 
of what the water sign people, okay? I am seeing you're finding your true north with your friends, family. You're seeing the ascendance. Pisces, you're always in love. <laughs> hey, Pisces. Pisces, you're always in love, okay? So I told you about the Capricorn person. So if you're in a relationship with a Capricorn person, they're going to bring you a lot of luck, okay? So if you're in a relationship with a Capricorn person, they're going to bring you a lot of luck. If you're in a relationship with a Taurus person, they're going to bring you a lot of luck, okay? Especially in your financial, with business assets and that sort of a thing. All righty, let's see what's happening. So where's the houses? So Cancer, you have a little problem. <laughs> Cancer, you have some problems, Cancer. Scorpion, I'm seeing unexpected changes and I hope it's for the best for you, Scorpions, because trust me, Scorpions, you have been getting, um, so much has been happening in your world. So in the first has what we have, we have the Virgos and this is what I was saying. Um, mm, the first house, um, is the house of yourself. And some of you are dealing with a Virgo. Um, there is an Aries and this Aries is in really, this Aries need to be removed out of your life. Okay. Cancers, you have some unexpected situation where you are going to be finding your not node. Okay. Then I'm seeing Pisces, you're going to have some luck with your money. Okay, Pisces, luck is coming up with your money. Then we have Taurus. Taurus is shaking up your environment, whoever you are. Um, Cancers, you're having a problem with Geminis because Geminis are moving you out. Okay, communication is here. Capricorn fall in their same house and there is luck for you guys. Okay, communication with the Aquarians are here. I'm seeing legal issues. This is going to be Saturn is coming in. If you are um, divorcing Scorpio, I see you fall in your own house. This is good Sagittarius. Um, whoa! Oh my God, Sagittarius fall in their own house. So I'm seeing Elin with travel issues and documentation. Uh, Elin with foreign situation. Okay, Pisces. Um, I'm seeing that. Uh, some of you Pisces are going to be connecting with the Leo. Hell no. Okay. Whatever is transpiring, some of you Pisces are going to be connecting with the Leo. Don't do it. All right. Or some of you could be ill in a situation with a Leo. Because I'm seeing that some of you, a Leo is in problem and they're going to be one to call you to ask you for help or connect with you. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Pisces is in your house. You're dealing with a Leo. Let it go. Don't do it. Whoever this Leo person is, Pisces, if you meet someone new and is a Leo, back up. No. Because I'm telling you, you are going to get yourself in some deep SHIT. So whoever this Leo person is that is trying to connect with you, they are using you. Okay? They are definitely using you. Do not do it lies deceptiveness don't do it pisces um um cancers you're dealing with a gemini the gemini's are seeing your true color the gemini's are thinking about letting you go so that is coming up um scorpio i'm seeing some unexpected surprises going to come up and you know you 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 scorpio has been dealing with so much things so so in the house of self i'm seeing Virgos are coming in. I see a time of healing. Pisces money is going to be good. The rest of you luck is going to be in your money aspect. Um, Tauruses are helping with a situation and an environmental situation. The Cancers, you're seeing your not node with your friendships um, in the, the house of Leo. So some of you Cancers are going to be connecting with Leo. That's your problem. Just connect with the Leos. Um, but Pisces keep away from Leo's anyone new a Leo that is come in your life keep them out of your life okay then I'm seeing the Aquarius in the sixth house some of you could be co collaborating with Aquarius so build something I am seeing with relationship I'm seeing upstanding people could be getting divorced um, that sort of a thing in relationship foreign situations I'm seeing a healing lies and deceptiveness and the healing that is transpiring 
um, in this 10th house I'm seeing Capricorns if you're in a relationship with a Capricorn a Capricorn is going to be bringing you luck okay the 10th house I'm seeing Pluto transition Pluto is removing an Aries out of your life whoever this Aries is it's like you come to the edge of this person and Pluto is removing this person out of your life 12 hours again Pisces whoever is a Leo um, whatever new love that is coming in whatever new love could be coming in with expressing yourself some of you are, have a, um, a problem with a Leo whoever this Leo is um, that you have known in past lifetime a karmatic situation I'm seeing a Leo in some problem they're going to be calling you don't don't get involved don't take the call keep them away from you you will be okay all right now I gotta go <laughs> I love you guys I gotta go alrighty so I'm saying to each and every person thank you for your positive warm support namaste until next time